And in the past couple of seconds, they have confirmed it, uh, that Mason Mount has signed from Chelsea that fee, uh, £60 million. He's uh, signed a contract until June 2028, we are hearing, with the option of a further year. The 24-year-old midfielder has made 279 club appearances, scoring 58 goals and contributing 53 assists. The Champions League winner was Chelsea's Player of the Year for both the 2021 and 2021-22 seasons. He has 36 caps for England, played a key role in his country's run to the European Championship final in 2021. Our man has said this about the move. It's never easy leaving the club where you grew up, but Manchester United will provide an exciting new challenge for the next phase of my career. Having competed against them, I know just how strong a squad it is that I'm joining and I can't wait to be a part of this group's drive to win major trophies. Everyone can see that the club has made big step forwards under Eric Ten Hag. Having met the manager and discussed his plans, I couldn't be more excited for the seasons ahead and I'm ready for the hard work expected here. I'm hugely ambitious. I know how amazing it feels to win major trophies and what it takes to do it. I'll be giving everything to experience that again at Manchester United. Well, Manchester United football director John Murto has also been speaking about the deal, saying Mason is an extremely intelligent footballer and has so many fantastic technical qualities that will significantly add to our squad. We have admired his talents for a long time, so we're delighted that he has chosen to take the next steps in his career here at Old Trafford. His style of play and attributes are a perfect fit for this squad and we all believe that he will only improve further working with Eric Ten Hag and his coaching staff. Mason himself is a world-class player but he also has the ability to improve the players around him through his game intelligence and tactical awareness. We are particularly impressed by his strong desire to join United and his thirst for further success as we push to drive up our performance levels next season and beyond. So, what we know about the deal is that it's 55 million guaranteed, an extra 5 million dependent on major trophies and appearances over several years. We're told Mount was Eric Ten Hag's number one choice for strengthening his midfield and the football director, John Murta, led those negotiations. He stood firm on that £55 million and United got the deal done despite interest from Arsenal and Liverpool. Well, this is how Mount said his goodbyes to Chelsea on social media, bringing an end to his 18-year association with Chelsea. Given the speculation over the last six months, this may not come as a surprise to you, but it doesn't make it any easier to tell you that I've made the decision to leave Chelsea. I feel we deserve more than just a written statement, so I wanted to tell you directly how grateful I've been for all of your support over the last 18 years. He is the sort of player that a club's identity should be built around. And I think that's all the more you would think relevant for Chelsea, given they are in this, I mean, OK, the new ownership's been there for over a year now, but it still, it still feels like we're in this transition from, from the Abramovich era. And you'd think, uh, given that, and given Mount's clear connection to the club, clear affinity and love for the club, he would be the sort of player that should represent its future. If you speak to kind of some people around Chelsea, as he has become almost the centre of a strange culture war among their fan base. Uh, and somehow, bizarrely, uh, just don't take to him. And that's all the more surprising. I mean, OK, you could argue maybe... Some of his talents aren't as obvious as, say, you know, some of the bigger global stars. But what is the most indicative thing of all about Mason Mount is that every single manager he's played under tends to love him. And that's primarily because he's such an intelligent player in terms of kind of a tactical application, especially in terms of, you know, applying complicated pressing demands. And that is exactly why Eric Ten Hag wants him. Well, since making his Premier League debut in August 2019, Mount ranks top for Chelsea at just about everything, most appearances, most starts, most minutes played, most goals, most assists and most chances created. Now here's a mystery. Since Mount released his goodbye video, social media has been speculating about how long ago he recorded the message because of the colour of his hair. Now in the video, Mount's hair is peroxide blonde. The first photo of him 
uh, like that was posted on social media on June the 11th. But when Mount was spotted at Carrington for his medical and United's official photos for the signing, he's back to his natural brown hair. So the question is, how long the deal has been close to concluding? Hmm. OK, so United's first signing of the window now complete and there could be an increased effort to get others over the line. Sky in Italy are reporting they made a verbal offer of £38 million for Inter Milan goalkeeper Andre Onana. We understand there remains a gap in valuation between the two teams in United do not want to overpay, so they continue to assess their options. However, Eric Ten Hag is keen on Anana. Meanwhile, talks also continue with David De Gea after his Old Trafford contract expired. Well, United are also looking at Fiorentina midfielder Sofian Amrabat. He's part of uh, Morocco's team, of course, that reached the World Cup semi-final and worked under Eric Ten Hag at Utrecht. Well, United are continuing to look in Serie A as they search for a new striker. They remain in talks over signing Rasmus Hoyland from Atalanta. There's still a gap in valuation and United will move on if they feel the deal is overpriced.